Hey, what's up guys? Obey Brandon here, showing you guys how to set up your Red Eye system. So I'm just going to show you guys how e quick and easy it is to set it up if you guys are on the edge about purchasing one or anything like that. So, if you guys have any questions, please get at me in the comment box. I'll try to answer them as fast as I can. So the first step is make sure you plug in your device. So when you plug it in, it'll turn the blue LED will turn on, and that's how you know it's on. There's no on and off switch on here. And then you want to plug in your dock adapter. Now that's uh, totally optional. You don't have to. I don't have mine because I use cases. And this dock also charges your iPod at the same time, which is really nice. So that's step one. Make sure you plug it in. Step two is download the app in the App Store. It's totally free. For the app to work, you have to make sure you have the Red Eye system. But the app's not going to work. And step three, connect to the Red Eye device. Now that you're trying, um, when they mean, what they mean by that is you want to connect to the Wi-Fi. Red Eye Wi-Fi network. So we're just going to go to settings, Wi-Fi, and make sure you're connected to the Red Eye. Now you'll have Red Eye when you uh, when you make sure when your Red Eye system is plugged in, the network will pop up like that. So you want to make sure you're connected to that, and then we're ready to go. You want to open up your application, go to the Setup tab. I already have my room set up, as you can see right here. The name, you just you can change that, serial number is already there, networking, that's all filled out for you. And then now you have all your devices. Now this startup, we're going to add a device. And then a list pops up with all these different companies. And it doesn't matter which one you pick. Uh, it doesn't really matter. If your company name is not in there, it doesn't matter. This is just for naming your device. So I have a Samsung, we're just going to put Olympus. Like, who cares. We're going to add a device, television. Model name, you can go in the back of the TV and look for your model name, but that does not matter at all. So we're just going to type in blah blah blah, save it, and it's going to save the device. And then once we do that, we're going to scroll down and add a command for the device. So we're going to add the command type is power on, you got a list of commands, a lot, big list all these lists you can set up your whole damn system and stuff but we're going to just leave it on power on toggles no power on description you can if you like command icon is already set up for you next thing you want to do is capture the control signal so you want to make sure you have your remote at this point and which I don't know where my remote oh, I have it right here so my remote's right here and we're going to capture control signal when you hit that button the red eye system will start the LED will start blinking indicating that it's time for you to take the press the appropriate button corresponding to the command type right here and then once you point and press at it while it's blinking the blinking should stop and then you should have assigned the control signal so when you do that right now capture control signal please point your see it's blinking when you hit the corresponding button to the corresponding command type and then you hit save and you want to make sure you have that right or it's not going to work so that's just one command. When I exit the setup, it saves automatically. When you go to the device I just made, which I believe it's this one, send a command to it, and then when you hit power, you want to make sure you have your red eye device somewhere where it can uh, access, send signals to your TVs and all your electronics. So it's right there. It's a pretty good height. My remote's right there, so you guys don't think I'm uh, lying. The TV's up there. I'm watching Food Network. And we're going to hit power on. Hopefully this works. <laughs> yep. And there you go. The TV's turned off. Docking system. It's on. I can turn that off too. Watch this, guys. Let's go back. Mint's docking system. Send command. See, if you guys see, I don't think you guys can see that, but the blue LED, uh, the green LED is on. So that means the docking system is on. We're going to hit power off or power on. And the blue LED is off. And there's no one else in my room, so if you guys think I'm kidding, this does work, guys. It's an awesome device. So, guys, thanks for watching. This was just a quick uh, setup video on my Canon G7. It's not on the bottom. The bottom's right there because it doesn't have macro sight. Hope you guys enjoy. Hope you like the quality. And I'll catch you guys later. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. And if you have any questions, please get at me in the comment box. Peace out, guys.